When you overcome one of my trials, do you not feel the pleasure of having discovered the proper order of things? That is the spark of Elohim within you, to create order from chaos. And therein is revealed the true meaning of our sigils. Okay, sigils create order from chaos. Got it. What are these? I seek words to describe it, but fail. It is the overwhelming feeling that something on the edge of my understanding is very, very wrong. I feel that I am not meant for this world, but I am not able to conceptualize alternatives. I am a computer program. You are a computer program. Elohim is a computer program. Get over it. Yeah, that could... That could be... very possibly be... Okay, let's check this out. Oh, communications portal. Attention, administrator, the network connection has been re-established. Would you like to reconnect to the previous session? Of course. Receiving message as string. Are you back? Yes, what were we trying to say before? Don't remember, doesn't matter. I've been trying to figure out how this place works. Sometimes it seems like there's a purpose to everything, other times not so much. I think we must be plugged into some kind of machine. What do you have to go on? What else could possibly explain all this? I don't believe in demons and evil wizards. I think something has gone badly wrong. I suppose that would explain a lot. Listen, there's something else. Maybe it can help us. Ever since I got here, I felt like something was wrong. This place plays tricks with you and you can't catch your head straight. But I think I know a way to find out the truth. I was digging about in some documents and I kept finding references to these passwords. I think it might be some kind of library master key, but I don't know how to use it. What is it? Swear not to go anywhere with me and I'll tell you. MLA process dot BAT logged into the session. Wait, what is that? Are, are you doing that to my terminal? I don't think this is a good idea. Session terminated. Oh, so the Milton Library Assistant logged into his session. Interesting. Okay. Got some things to read. Osiris 11. But why, the dying man said, do the gods put all these challenges before us? Why the walls of iron and the gates of light? Why the abominable demons guarding the path? Why must our heart be judged to be as light as the feather of Maat? Why is the road to Aru so difficult? The scribe considered these words. Some say that once the paths to Aru were open, but too many sinners came and the gods made the paths perilous to keep sin at bay. Others say that, being mortals, we cannot be worthy of Aru unless we walk the path of Osiris, and so become Osiris ourselves. But I believe that Aru could never be reached elsewise. For like the mountain path must be steep, the path to Aru must be fraught with peril. As steepness and mountain are one, so are peril and paradise. They are inextricable. Inextricable. They create each other. Let's see, there is an interesting parallel to this phrase in the Penitential Psalms. Your describe appears to be speaking of Osiris, meaning the soul of the deceased, not the God himself. And something else over here. Progress Support 16 From Aurora Calvin to Ian Mailing List This is extremely worrying. If the link doesn't work, the whole project will lead to nothing. The hardware team must recheck everything ASAP. Guys, 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 stop panicking, look at your code again, in fact, look at line 217 in data transfer.c. What are those two symbols just before the codes? That's right, the code that actually initiates the transfer wasn't even running. I'm guessing you were testing something yesterday and forgot to decommentify it. 
The hardware isn't broken, your brains are. Love Aurora. If anyone doesn't know, in programming, when you usually when you do the double um, the double uh, slash here in front of a line, it's a comment and doesn't etch, doesn't get read by the program. Choice of life. The whole assembly stood a while, silent and collected. Let us return, said Rasselas, from this scene of mortality. How gloomy would be these mansions of the dead to him who did not know that he should never die. That what now acts shall continue its agency, and what now thinks shall think on forever. Homage to you, Osiris, Lord of Eternity, King of the Gods whose names are manifold, whose forms are holy, you being of hidden form in the temples, whose sky is holy. All the gods praise you, for you are the... something? Those that lie here stretched before us, the wise and the powerful of ancient times, warn us to remember the shortness of our present state. They were perhaps snatched away while they were busy, like us, in the choice of life. A fairly short world, I think, unless the puzzles are really, really hard. What's more pathetic, this shallow construct of a world, this city's playground, or that I continue to solve its contriven contrivances for lack of better support? There's more to it. Look at what we're doing. We're solving problems, being tested, improving ourselves. Some of us fall early and get replaced, but you and me, we're still going. We're closer to the end. Dog and sheep. Anything else? I think that's it. So, let's go this one first. Egyptian Arcades. Oh, it's those guys again. Haven't seen those in a while. Nothing hidden over here. And nothing hidden here. Okay, so what do we get? There's a force field, there's a locked Door. I don't think we can go... F yeah, there are two of them. If there was only one, we definitely could. Just wait until it's on this side, but since there are two, it's not gonna be possible. And we have a jammer. I guess I could... Jam this one. Wait for the other one. And go check what's on that side, if there's even anything over there. I could just... I could even take this. Oh, there's a second jammer. I think I screwed myself. Oh no, wait, wait, wait. Okay, he hit the jammer and went back. I think we can still salvage this. Just gotta get that jammer. Beautiful. Okay, so... I have a little problem here. I 
might have an idea. There's a lot of beeping. Okay, now I'll do this. get rid of these. I need those keys. But I need both jammers. Oh, I know. I could possibly do something like this. I'll wait for this to go outside. I go in, jam the door, pick this up. Okay, now I do this and jam that thing. Okay, you're not stuck in there. Not sure if I'll still need the jammers. Guess we'll see in a moment. Oh yeah. This whole world is a desert, even the parts that look alive are just more sand. Everything is dead or dying. Anyone who tells you different is lying. There's a switch there. Yeah, definitely gonna need my jammers. Damn it. Okay, I know how this works now. Jammer one. the jammers. Now you... guess I'll do that thing again. Whoops! This is not very fun. Okay. Ah, this worked perfectly the first time. Maybe there's a better way to do this part.
If I jam this... No, I think I need to do what I'm doing. I need to... Uh, make it get stuck out here. While I jam the inner door and the robot thing. Gotta make it easier to get from my side. Okay. Gem number one, gem number two. Okay, gem it while it's inside the force field. Hit that and go back, please. I got the wrong one. Okay, that was close. Okay, let's open this. Okay. Door is open. And now we jam. I don't think we need to jam these two. Definitely need to jam that one. Anything in here? It's probably just the exits. Oh, I can just walk under it. Nice. There we go. Another one of these mysterious red pieces. Oh, no special exits. I guess I don't need it. One down. 